Okay, I'm all suited up. I've got my gloves, my thick socks. Why? Because I am about to climb into the cryotherapy chamber to show you exactly what it's like. A lot of conditions. 30 seconds. Standing in negative 220 degree Fahrenheit for two and a half minutes. People swear 25. by it for pain relief. But well, when you get out, man, you feel great. Extreme athletes like Dale Mabry CrossFit owner Robert Frank and head trainer Sonny Alexander tried cryotherapy to ease muscle soreness and strain. Immediately I felt better effects, like less soreness in my joints. I felt like perhaps the inflammation was, was down. The muscle soreness was down, um, <clears throat> just felt good. Cryo is compared to an ice bath for athletes, but Dr. Tommy Ree tells me it's brief and doesn't damage skin tissue. We see patients from, of course, the athletes. Then we have the autoimmune, fibromyalgia, anybody that has that inflammation or some type of, uh, how would you say, like a pain threshold that's that's kind of irritated by the inflammation. Yeah, just keep walking. Take a nice Before walk. trying the experience like I did, here's what you need to know to stay safe. You need someone licensed and trained by your side to guide you along the way. We're all by the uh, patients making sure we have eye contact the whole entire time and having a little communication as we go through the process. Keep your head above the mist. When you're above the mist, you're okay. That's the nitrogen. I mean, we breathe nitrogen. There's 80% of nitrogen in the air. And bear in mind, it gets cold. Females, you guys are naked. Sorry about that. But and the males, we have to wear uh, briefs. We have to protect ourselves. When your two minutes are up, you're out fast. <sighs> that was cold. <laughs> Gail Guayardo, so News perfect. Channel 8. You know, it's like, uh, I don't know, because I just did a leg workout yesterday. And your knees when you got out felt wobbly. Well, everything.